Thank you for everybody being here. Um, the easiest thing about getting Irish people together is that uh, we all generally are very proud of where we come from, whether we're Irish or Irish-American. And uh, without question, I think it's uh, the one common denominator. And I've probably met most of you in the room. And um, I can say that uh, any time I've asked anybody to do anything, whether it's you know, John from Andreessen or John from Kleiner or our chairman Craig, the answer has been a very easy yes. So the Irish diaspora is, is without question one of the strongest uh, assets that I believe Ireland has. And uh, that's one of the great things that we have. And I think that a network is something that's hugely important to a company. You know, young companies need access to talent, they need access to customers, they need access to capital. Well, the network that's here tonight has access to all those things. And I think uh, what we're doing in the ITLG is trying to create a platform for Irish companies to be able to leverage that uh, in, in every way they can. So um, I want to thank a number of people and a number of organizations today. Um, first and foremost, uh, Jerry Staunton is uh, Consul General of Ireland, uh, responsible for 13 states. I I'd be out in Hawaii a lot more, J Jerry. You need to visit that community. Um, but uh, Jerry has been a huge supporter of, of what we've been doing, and so also have the Department of Foreign Affairs. And to be honest with you, I don't think we'd be able to put together the organization that we have and an event like this without the support of uh, the DFA, and also with Enterprise Ireland, and also with Invest Northern Ireland, and also with the IDA. So I want to say a special thank you to uh, those folks. Uh, the Silicon Valley 50 uh, is a new event, uh, a new part of our event. Uh, we're really delighted to be able to do that. It's, uh, it's incredible, the talent that's across, not just the US, but across the world that has an Irish uh, connection. So it's an unlimited uh, access to, uh, to, to great people. And I, and I want to thank the folks that came here tonight. I know many of you have, have been here, but many of you have actually come from other parts of, you know, of the US. So I really appreciate you, you coming here tonight and supporting what, what, what we're doing. Um, you know, Craig, uh, obviously uh, you're uh, a well-known rock star here in, in California and specifically in Stanford. Uh, Craig has been a, a very good friend uh, to Ireland, but he's also been a, a, a friend with uh, tough messages that both the Irish government and Irish people need to hear in terms of some of the challenges that we need to face in terms of investment in innovation, investment in education. And uh, I want to thank Craig for the, for the efforts that he has done. He's come over to Ireland on numerous occasions. Obviously, his background with regard to Intel. Intel have been in Ireland for over 20 years, invested more than $7 billion, in, and um, employ over 5,000 people in Ireland. And uh, that was uh, during Craig's leadership. And also, you know, Craig's leadership in the ITLG has uh, certainly been very, very strong. Um, I don't think uh, he has refused anything that we've asked him along the way, uh, even though we've been uh, tough on his time. But I'm uh, really delighted to have Craig here. So, Craig, I'll uh, invite you to stage. Thank you. 